For years, Diana was my sole handler at the agency. She supplied information and secrecy, and I sold perfection. We had trust. Then last August 10th, Diana brought the agency to its knees. She flushed all accounts, cut off all communication lines, exposed the agents, and used the confusion to vanish. Now the reformed agency has finally tracked her down and offered me the contract. One day, I will think of this as just another job. After all, this is what I do. Listen to me. I need you to be brave. A man will come and take you away. I cannot go with you. This is how it has to be. This man is different. He will protect you. Please don't judge him for what he might do. I'm sorry. Maybe someday you will understand. Forty-seven. This is Benjamin Travis. The money has been wired to your account. Welcome to Chicago. I appreciate you taking this assignment, 47. It is never easy targeting our own, but Diana Burnwood's treason must be dealt with. I would send in one of the teams, but this is a job for a scalpel, not a hammer. Reasons are irrelevant. Exactly. Good luck, 47. Sir. Yeah, it's an ice cream truck. Yeah, I know. I'll get rid of him. Hey, get out of here. We don't want anything. What about your partner? What partner? During this assignment, key game elements will be highlighted. First of all, try to kill with discretion and try to remain undetected. Let's look at the interface. In the lower left corner, the blue bar indicates your health. Next to it is the radar. Use it to keep track of enemies, objectives, and exit points. In the lower right corner, you can see what weapon you have selected and if it's hidden. Next to the weapon, the yellow bar indicates how much instinct you have available. 
According to ICA Division Chief Benjamin Travis, my former handler Diana Burnwood has gone rogue, taking with her a valuable agency asset, a girl named Victoria. After months underground, Diana's safe house has been located, a heavily guarded mansion on the shores of Lake Michigan. My objective? Eliminate Diana and retrieve the girl. Personal note. Diana saved my life. Although the grounds for termination are just, I take no pride in this assignment. From here on out, I shall refer to her only as my target. I must not get personally involved. If it is depleted, you cannot rely on instinct abilities. Approach the cover in front of you. This is four. We need to set up security at the wall entrance. To get the full benefit of this introduction, try to remain unseen and kill with discretion. Clean kill. Remember to hide the body. Bodies left in plain sight will alert your enemies. The body is now hidden. The container has room for... Use your fiber wire to silently eliminate the guard up ahead. Clean kill. Notice the fiber wire allows you to drag your target immediately. The container is now full. There is no more room for additional bodies or for you to hide. Clean kill. Remember to hide the body. Bodies left in plain sight will alert your enemies. Agent 47's training and supreme senses allow him to keenly perceive his surroundings. Oh, and uh, act natural, okay? We're not supposed to know about the uh, head stuff. I think it's old school. It's not one to air his dirty laundry and distraction, public. steady aim, or fiber wire. The choice is yours. Wait and listen to the people around you. They may give vital information or simply let you know when the coast is clear. My wife's the state champion in gossip. It's only a matter of time. Not that I don't appreciate your concern. Mark my words, kid. You should get out of Use instinct or consult the radar to locate the exit. This travel agency only has two destinations. Death and depression. And either way, you can be damn sure it's gonna rain the whole time. No one speaks your language in a hotel Use instinct to anticipate enemy movement. Looks like the chef's cooking up a storm. Mmm. I tell you, this gig is like watching paint dry. But at least the service is good. Edged and piercing weapons can be used for deadly throws as well as distractions. Focus on a target. The greenhouse up ahead will require a disguise to infiltrate unnoticed. You are disguised as a gardener. In this disguise, you are allowed to be in the greenhouse area. Be mindful that other gardeners see through your disguise if you come too close. Trick the gardener. You slip past unnoticed. In doing so, you expended instinct. You will regain instinct by completing objectives, performing silent takedowns, 
assassinating your targets, or finding clever ways to bypass your enemies. No school, no friends coming over. Bit odd, don't you think? Hi. I don't know. Maybe. Sorry, pal. New rules. This area is off limits unless you're security or guests of Miss Burnwood. What? Why? What if we need to use the restroom? What am I, an information board? Just following orders, pal. I suggest you do the same. Use a flower bed or something. Perfect. Just perfect. I'm gonna kill these maintenance clowns. The gods have been dealt with. Doing so, you regain some instinct. Come on. Let's check out the boats. The guards are preoccupied. You can kill them or sneak past. The choice is yours. Leaving people alive is cleaner, but might complicate your effort to remain undetected. Yet this is the mark of the silent assassin, to leave the world around him unaware and untouched. And through the compound. Accessing mansion and approaching target. Good. Infiltrate the mansion and terminate Diana Burnwood. And Victoria, bring her in. Unharmed. She is very dear to me and the agency. What? You're kidding. Wait, are, are you sure? It's not prostate cancer. Oh, oh, oh. I could kiss you. I mean, that's great news. Oh, man. You made my day. Yeah, thanks, Doc. Yeah. Oh, man. I thought I was a goner. Yeah. Uh, Doc, I gotta run. Duty calls. And, and thank you so much. Uh, you have a nice day, too. Yeah, bye. Woo! Man, no one can piss on this day. You are now inside the mansion. Your current disguise will be suspicious to the mansion guards. Either find a new disguise or try to remain undetected. Subdue or kill. The choice is yours. Either way, he won't be waking up anytime soon. The mansion guard disguise gives you full access to the mansion interior. Be mindful that other mansion guards see through your disguise if you come too close, so keep a safe distance. Throughout the game you will find evidence. Removing the evidence will award you rating point. Beyond this door, the rating system will be turned on. It will monitor your playstyle and reward your progress. You can see it in the top left corner. As always, how you handle your assignment is entirely up to you. Good luck. Come on, you can tell me. My Use instinct to locate objects of interest. Is a trade secret handed down from master to apprentice for centuries. I will take the secret ingredient with me to the grave. Uh huh. Is it salt? No. No. What do you take me for? Salt? Please. I am one of the finest chefs in this culinary wasteland. You culination. You put liquid butter on your popcorn, and you have the nerve to make assumptions about my award-winning recipes, salt. Shame on you, sir. Shame. Now go on. Get out of here. Shh, 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 shh. All right, all right, relax. I was only asking. Christ, don't have a heart attack. Out, I say. Go guard a gate or shoot at some beer cans, you big ape. Sacred blue. Ah. The body is now hidden. The container has room for one more body and still has room for you. You are disguised as a chef. You are allowed everywhere in the ground floor mansion area. No one in the mansion will see through this disguise, but be mindful not to carry visible weapons as they will cause suspicion. And we'll be down shortly. The girl's in her room and will remain so for the time being. For those of you who do not know the drill, I will personally appoint a close protection host for each client on a six-hour shift cycle. You will not, I repeat not, leave your VIP side for any reason during your shift. Any breach of procedure will result in immediate termination and subsequent blacklisting. 
Rest assured, if you fail in your duties, you will never work in this business again. This is all. Dismissed. Don't hang around if you don't have business here, sir. So, so you were on close protection duty yesterday, right? Did you talk to the girl? Barely. She's polite, but kind of introverted. Just sits there, staring into space. Kid must have some kind of baggage. New chef's assistant. Why was I not informed? <sighs> Report with my intel officer after duty for a security check. This is Alpha. I don't care. Order one of those mobile restrooms to put in the gardens. I will not risk infiltration by allowing anyone into the mansion that has not been directly approved by myself or by my closest staff. See that it is done. Over. I tell you, of all the clients I've worked with, this has got to be the strangest. She's a cloak and dagger kind of girl, that's for sure. Guatemala. What's her story perfect anyway? Flavor, perfect temperature. Nobody seems to know. Not Chef even knows his of... coffee. But I caught a glimpse of the documents the other day when I was on escort duty. They had some skull and bones logo in the words, uh, Mercis Letifer. So how do you get in a heads in for close protection duty? I wouldn't mind bodyguarding the client. You know what I mean? You're a class act, man. Don't act so high and mighty. I've seen you got in Maybe we should just see This is Alpha. Have you scanned the truck for explosives? Put two men on it and check the remains. Maybe the driver has an accident. If your score is high enough, you will unlock an assassin technique. Open the notebook to see your next unlock. Closing in on target. Well done, 47. Now remember, Diana brought this on herself. She betrayed us, the agency, the code, everything we stand for. She is too dangerous to be left alive. Think about that when you pull the trigger.
47? <laughs> Report 47. I should kill you. Why did you do this? 47! Goddammit, what's wrong with this thing? We all have our limits. Even you, 47. We used to have honor. Diana, I... No. I had to take her away from the doctors. I knew you would understand. Fuck. Something's not right. There's no time. You still have a chance. In my robe. A letter. Now go. Take the girl and run. Before Travis finds out. Please. Do not let her turn into you. Promise me. I promise. Running is noisy and makes it easier for your enemies to spot you. Agent 47 can deal with enemies swiftly and with great precision. Note that while you are focusing on your targets, you expend instinct rapidly. Turn the camera to focus on your enemy, then lock the shot. Fatal damage. Focus on the next enemy. All enemies... You know who I am. I know. She's dead, isn't she? Come on, stay close to me. Where are we going? Get in. It's done. Excellent work, 47. Bring the girl to the extraction point. Why did the Agency want you? I don't know, I guess I might have... <gasps> Diana did this for you, why? Please, she was my only friend. She took me away from the doctors. Tell me about the doctors. It's really blurry. Like, a really bad dream. Why? We need to go. Sir, there's nobody here. I think the asset has gone AWOL. God damn it! I was afraid he couldn't do it. I want every agent on this. You hear me, Jade? Locate 47 before he slips between the cracks. You need to get off the streets. The agency knows my secure locations, and they will be searching for us. This is the safest place I know. Can I come with you? You need to hide, till I know what's going on. Oh, it was you who called? Yes. Oh. You must be Victoria. Come on in, child.
Thank you for your help. This girl is important. Take this. We will take good care of her, my son. Diana said you need that necklace. Don't lose it. Will you come back? I'll be watching. at the pagoda in the center of town where a unit of dirty cops guard his every move. And he rarely leaves the crowd except to meet up with his dealer in a pad overlooking the square. Yeah, he's also got a swanky European ride parked in a nearby alley. And that's all I got, Holmes. So, call me back when you're done. Got it? Sit on your asses. Nobody gets up here without my permission. There are countless ways to assassinate the King of Chinatown. Twelve of these assassinations will unlock challenges. To view the challenges, consult the notebook. A completed. Birdie, once the agency's top intelligence man, in order to protect the girl, I need him as my eyes and ears. But his services won't come cheap. This man is a merchant. Quid pro quo. Everything comes with a price. To recruit him, I must first take out his business rifle. Official contract or not, this king of Chinatown has to die. Thank you so much. Have a good day. That is threatening oh, okay. behavior. May I remind you that 
I'm an officer of the law. You'll love it. And you want some what? Spanish bathroom? You? Ma'am? Okay, thank you for waiting very patiently. We're up. Good line now. Come on, we can take your turn. I've got plenty for everyone. Just like Mama used to make. Sir, please. please. Me to the goods. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get myself some snow. <laughs> oh, hey, when you're the king of Chinatown. Oh yeah. <sighs> Yeah. 
Hey, man. Hey. <laughs> oh, what? You live in this shithole? Christ. Don't bring your mean ass to my home. I need information. Well, that's my business. Information. You need information, I find information. At a price, of course. You're damn right at a price. Of course. Girl named Victoria. The agency wants her bad. I need to know why. No, wait, 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 wait. D the agency. You want me to snoop around the agency? Were you crazy? Yeah, you crazy. All right, what is it worth to you? Name your price. <clears throat> well... <clears throat> tools. Listen to the city. <laughs> if anyone mentions the girl, you know what to do. I'll call you. You do that.
Yes. Terminus Hotel, room 899. my bird the question, Holmes, and the answer came back in the shape of a name. Blake Dexter. An arms industry VIP who seems to have taken a special interest in you, girl. Dexter occupies the Terminus's top floor, and his thug has the place sealed off tight. Still, a man of your skills and resources should be able to find several access points. Good luck, Holmes. and watch outside in this weather? That is harsh. Tell me about it. Why don't you just come inside for a minute? What are they gonna do, right? <laughs> Clearly you've never met my employer. Yeah, goddamn fans on this Jew. No respect for property. If you were my husband, I'd poison you with me. Oh yeah, how about a little arsenic in with the Yale? I'd cut your dick off and throw it to the alligators in the zoo. Messing around with electricity in a flooded pit? Not for a million bucks, no sir! Shit. Man, that's Joe for you. Hey, he's like a living legend downtown. Did you believe he was struck by lightning once? Damn straight. Bastard walked away without a scratch, too. Some of the guys say he can even turn on a light bulb just by snapping his fingers. Oh. this
colossal son of a bitch. Ooh, you're approaching the lion's den now. Thugs you encountered are gonna have the eighth floor completely under lockdown. Now Blake Dexter, he enjoys his privacy. And sneaking into 899 is not gonna be an easy task. And to make matters worse, this is protected by a seriously nasty bodyguard who will not, and I repeat, not take kindly to trespassers. She should probably look to get off at a lower floor and look for a more subtle entry point. But what am I saying? A pro like you, you probably got the whole thing figured out, don't you? Alright, go get him. Stairwell's secure? Uh-huh. Seal up tight. Nobody disturbs Mr. Dexter without our permission. Ah, oh, hey, handsome. Good. You're looking and good. no incidents here. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Yeah, no, I got tickets. You know that. Wow. This takes me back, man. When I was a kid, Lie up on the roof over the porch, you know, looking out at the clouds and listening to my sister play the violin. Back then, I wanted the world, you know. It's a way to grow up. Go places. Make something of myself. Hello? Uh, I saw him. Oh, interesting. I like shoes. Well, I bet you do. You've got very pretty feet. And I know feet. <laughs> Oh, uh, th uh, I hate my feet. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, 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 no. They're very nice. Best client in Chicago, Don. Ron, Ron. Uh, sorry, but listen, I can give you 30% off if you take the whole lot. I, I don't blame you one bit. That last shipment had its flaws, but we fixed those particular problems and, and we want to win back your business, so. Uh, uh, yes, but, but we fixed those problems. I, I, I know, I told you. We. Look, I'll, I'll cover the shipping. How's that? How, how about this? 35% off, and, and, I'll, and I'll throw in. No, of, of course they'll sell. They're gonna jump off your shelves. They'll, they'll, they'll leap right off. Just, just bounding shoes, cascading down. 40% done. I mean, Ron, 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 stay with me. L listen, listen. Uh, half the lot then. H half the lot, 45% off, and that's my final offer. Now, there is no call for that kind of language. I, I understand your skepticism, but I am telling you, Done. Done. I mean, uh, Ron, Ron, Ron.
What? Blood keeps messing up my energy flow. Hello? Who man is like spreading bad vibes out here? Hello, anyone? Hey, get over here. Come on. Turn this thing off, will you? Her name is Victoria, and she's worth a lot of fucking money. Ah, she's some kind of enhanced wonder child or something. Point is, we go in, we grab her, we hang on to her until they give us the ransom. She sounds like something you came up with in one of your labs. Oh, who the fuck asked for your opinion anyway? You're a fucking asshole, you know that? You know, your job is to shut up, do what I say, and look good. 
And you do look good, honey. <laughs> Sweet talker. a knock. Good work, Sanchez. Yeah. What is he? Is he a cop? Is he a PI or something? Well, fuck me gently. Oh. Oh. What the fuck? That ain't no fucking private eye. That's a fucking ghost. That, that's a myth. That, that's a fucking hitman. Hitman? Oh, shit. This fucking changes everything. This is this changes everything. <laughs> what the fuck are we gonna do with him? Knock knock knock. Housekeeping. Hello. What are you doing? Shh. Buenos dias, Peter. Hello. Yeah, we got us a little mess in here. Why don't you come on in and oh, clean it up? You. Yeah, that'd be good. See now? Sure, come on in, darling. Add a girl. Oh my god, these Death your goat! Oh god! You fucking animal! <laughs> and that's what I call a sweet slice. You know, nothing would give me more pleasure than to kill you right here and now. Me kill the legendary hitman, yeah, but uh. I don't need that kind of attention. So, uh... Oh dear. Oh dear. You've done a bad, bad thing. <laughs> well, now they won't be looking for a killer, will they? Huh? Killer. <laughs> yee ha! ha! I tell you, I don't ordinarily yee-haw. But this is a fucking yeehaw! Fucking Christmas! Here, take a slash. Nah. On second thought. Tinkle, tinkle, little jar. Wait, could you please not do that? This is a bad plan. Put a giddy up in your step. <laughs> Adios.
We won't get a second shot at this. Fire's boys are about to take over the operation. Everything clear. Disembarked to Hyde Park is coming in.
Just about to. Secure the area up there. Gotta be. All right. Get to work. Guy. He's jumping buildings, dodging helicopter fire. What's going on here? Gotta be ex-military. 
Yeah, you know, my, uh, my cousin Anthony, he, uh, he's combat soldiers with, the uh, what is that, the, oh, that PTSD, you know, and some of these guys, when they snap, they fucking snap, you know? this floor a couple weeks back for the for domestic disturbance, right? And the landlord was complaining you that the building are smelled not like normal. pine trees. <laughs> I guess we know now why. So this cracker, he breaks his leg in a fight, right? He walks to the hospital by himself. <laughs> it gets better. Guy walks up to the front desk, and then starts screaming. He's out. There's a small axe stuck in his head. No shit! Hey, anyone seen a combination for this safe? List conspiracy, Jackson. Now, in your book, you check mentioned... it out. Thank you. Hello, anyone here? What radio is this? Only a radio. Never mind. Oh. 
Hey, guys, get a load of this. Bucks, I know you from somewhere. Oh, it's nice to see another uniform. See you in the shower later. Some kind of murder investigation. Already closed off all no. the tracks. Do not. Yeah, I'm pretty That's sure they can do that. They're the police. What do you want from me? Hey, not you. This you know, it's my hey, ass hey, on the line down here. Wait, you call I City Hall if you want to yell at somebody. I got 400 angry and commuters to spring a bill and tell them, hey man, we gotta hold on. Asshole.
coming. Some bald killer on the loose. Yeah, I'm, I'm freaked out. No, I, I didn't want to worry about it. after Victoria. I need to stop him before he gets too close. Man, he already too close. You want my advice? You take that girl and you run. I never did believe in running. According to my sources, the girl is in Chicago. Me and the boys are leaving ASAP. I need you along to spearhead the operation. Are you in? Wait. I heard you. You want me to snatch some chick? Name's Victoria. Dom is gonna call you, tell you how to find her. She's in hiding somewhere. You got that? That's a lot of hassle for one chick. She must be special. I need to bring my boys. That means double my fee. Mm. Take Lenny with you. He can bring her back when you find her. Lenny, limp dick? Trip on my feet. <laughs> Sorry, the kid's a dipshit. 25. 39. 26. 37. 30. 35. Deal. <laughs> Lenny, come give the man a line. <sighs> come on, Limp Dick. Limp Dick Lenny. <laughs> Shut up, Wade! <laughs> I like good old Wade, I really do. Son of a bitch makes my skin crawl. Oh, that's probably why I like him. <laughs> now, Black Dex is a ruthless son of a bitch for sure, but the guy you really need to worry about is his business partner, Tom Osman, owner of the Vixen Club over on Bristol Street. This prick is bad new homes, even by my standards. I mean, he's clever and really connected. And it's only a matter of time before he tracks down your girl at the orphanage. How do you know about that? Hey, Chicago knows, I know. <laughs> Dom ain't all that different. Send me his picture.
all around this place. Goddamn garbage lying around and everything. Oh my god. Fucking shit. Hey. I found something. Yeah? What? I don't know. It's like a, an altar or something. It looks like... It, hey, wait. Hey, what's happening on the Hawaii case? Huh? Not our problem. We need to find the suspect. That's all you have to worry about. We're both or we'll chew our asses off. Yeah, roger that. Just, uh... Look, call somebody down here, okay? Could be a lead or something. Will do. Tomorrow. Don't worry about it anymore. All right, all right. Over and out. every night? <laughs> there ain't no room in this brain for a conscience. Yeah, what, do we look like Santa's elves protecting the North Pole? This ain't a fucking nice business. This ain't a nice fucking neighborhood. Come on. Hank. Now remember, when you get you know, inside Hank, the Vixen Hank Club, knows. look toward the bar. Because Dom, he likes to be where the action is.
Right. Well, what do you say to you and me? A bottle of tequila and a cheap motel room. Right. No touching. Hey, Legs! Get in here for a minute. Let me see your moves. Come on, show me what you got. It's nice, it's good. Do that, do that Alabama wildflower I like. Hey, yeah, nice. Now don't be afraid to shake that ass for me. Good, okay, get out of here, go, go! It's Dom, I'm sending up a new girl. Yeah, Wade is gonna go apeshit for this one. Did you prep the Hawaii room? Good. Make sure there's whiskey and plenty of it. Spare no expense. Oh, and some smoked salmon. Wade's really into that. Only the best for my buddies, right? <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> safe out there. his friends I'd be going to Hawaii hey hey look you just got to entertain his friends don't let them think they own you and just think of something positive we we've all been there honey luckily they don't ask twice <laughs>
he is working with the hitman. We need his wings clipped now. You call me back when you got a lock on that girl. Dexter smells a fortune. I intend to get my fair share. I'll see you soon, old boy. You were right. Dom was searching for Victoria. I got to him just in time. Good for you, Holmes. Kudos. He was on to you as well. A man is coming. A man named Wade. That guy's crazier than a shithouse rat. You need to get your ass over here right away, because this is about to get very loud and very messy. I have to call you back. to be looking for a corpse or something? I know it's a shit job. I, I, I'm your boss. It's an honest job, but someone's gotta do it. Hmm. You've been giving this a lot of thought, huh? Ah, oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Relax, guys! We ain't gonna find jack shit by arguing about the merits of fucking titty dancing. Get your shit together, okay? You're right. All right. So we check the whole area? Yeah, the whole floor is swept. The others are giving it a second co op that's good, but we gotta think creative here. Whoever this sick bastard is, he's been outsmarting us. Somewhere. I just know it. I can't find anything. Ah, yeah, me neither. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, shit. That wasn't there a minute ago. Don't move! You might be smart enough to give up, but I don't trust your face once. I'm on my way back to Chinatown. Stay low and watch your back. Oh yeah? Well, 
that's easy for you to say, Holmes. Man, that Wade, they say he got ways to make you talk. And you and I both know that I got a lot of shit to say, so hurry! Just stay calm. owner now. And you think it was murder, huh? No, no, I haven't seen anybody. I could say the same about you. <laughs> How long have you been waiting to do that one, huh? That came to me last night. I even got up to write it down so I wouldn't forget. <laughs> Seriously? That was uh, ambitious of you. Oh, I understand. I tell you kids, don't grow old and don't let your prostate. Oh my God. Don't worry. I'm a little fast guy, young guy. Okay. Well, then you're a damn fool. I say, with a moderate pace, die middle age. Preferably from a stroke on the golf course. Or in a hotel room, snuggled between the titties of my secretary. You don't have a secretary. And I don't Hey, uh, you see a tall, bald guy look like a bum in the neighborhood the past couple hours? You really want to know? Oh, sorry, I'm in a plane crash at the age of 27, after my debut album was number one, right before it started to a difficult second album. You know, so... <laughs> Like that. But that is my voice. 
I can't help it. Are you okay? You know what? You should have asked the bird man. Maybe he knew something. Yeah. Wouldn't help you and I know that she thinks I'm being you. guys in the crowd asking questions. It's only a matter of time before they see me. You gotta get me out of here, Holmes. You got to. You got to. For your own damn good. Bertie, focus. Don't do anything foolish. I will take care of this. was to say birdie, then you would respond, what? Uh, you want roast duck? Wrong answer. <clears throat> okay, asshole, here we go. Once more for the hearing impaired, where's the guy they call birdie? 
And what about that bald son of a bitch, huh? Start talking. Please! I don't know about any birdie! Ah, shit. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna count down from ten. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Ah, oh, shit, the hell with this. I got a table at the Vixen. Heavy firepower. I got this uh, thing coming up. Yeah, like I did. Hey, 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 you got the new HX UMPs, huh? Uh, I've been wanting to try one of those. Nice. Uh, mm, an armor tip bullets. Those could come in handy. Hell, I'll just take one of everything. Hey! What the hell? Where's that goddamn file? Yeah. You damn if I know. It was lying right there. Look, jerk off! I don't know what you're trying to pull here, but I want my goddamn money back! Hey! Screw you! Who the hell All right, city boy! What the- oh. He left with this cowboy guy. Real nasty looking piece of work. They were going downtown, I think. Too late, 47. I gotta do what I gotta do. <laughs> 
Tell me, Mr. Wade, what would you rather do? Find a girl? Or waste a bullet? Clock is ticking. It's so empty here without the children. I wish I could have gone on that field trip with them. Oh, it's you. I'm glad you're here. Victoria's sick. One minute she's fine, and the next she's hardly breathing, and the doctors can't find anything wrong with her. A necklace. A necklace? Well, well, it's on the dresser. She broke the latch, but I fixed it. Has anyone been asking about her? No. They're here. I've got to move Victoria fast. Where's the safest place in the building? Oh, uh... Oh, the basement! The basement! Get down there quickly. I'll meet you there with Victoria. Yes, yes, of course. Oh, heaven be praised. Oh. Come. <coughs> Thank you. You came back. Just like you said. I was so, so scared. Were those gunshots? Don't worry. I promised Diana to keep you safe. I know what you've been through. No one will harm you ever again. What's that noise? Shh. Don't make a sound. It's not noise. I mean, it's just... I mean, God, whatever happened to duct tape? That's Wade for you. The guy likes his carnage. Sick, sick shit. Get some off. That's probably why he's never been caught. back on. Sister Mary is waiting in the basement. I will meet you both there. What the hell are we doing? Finishing off what we started. Let's go. We gotta find the girl. <gasps> They're hurting him good. Well, if we don't find her, Wade will rip us all a new asshole. Go and find out what they got. Yeah, yeah, we're tearing up the place. No sign yet.
Oh, you should have seen him, man. Pissing himself. A grown man. Do you believe it? Yeah. You ask me? He deserved to die. <laughs> you sure made a mess of him. Damn straight I did. before he tears all you sorry punks a new one. So look harder. Tear everything apart. Let's get going. Shit. He pissed. You better split, buddy. Shit's going down. Have you looked over there? I gotta, I gotta do something got. about this. Hey, buddy. You don't want to be here. Hey, you see anything? I got nothing here. Okay. You better keep Sounds going. Bad right. shit's going down. Very bad. Fast. Uh, 
I know him. Where is he? Come on, guys, look alive. It's clean. Shit. Oh, this is fucked. been waving that little thing around all day, haven't you? <laughs> Shut up, Wayne! Oh. <laughs> oh! Oh! You think you're a tough guy, Lenny? Hmm? Tough guy? Stop it! Come on, man, you tough guy? Come on! Come on, you tough guy? Come on, man! No! Come on! Okay, I'll show you! Uh. Shut up, bitch! Oh! Or I'll put a cap in your ass! Look out, everybody! We better make room for Lip Dick Lenny! Come on! You know what, Wayne? Just... Oh! 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 my God! Oh! I got blood on oh! my hand, Wayne! Y'all see that? This is like pop like a watermelon! <laughs> Lenny! <laughs> I'll tell you what, Lenny. We better let the grown-ups clean up this. Mm-mm. You boys keep watch, huh? Nice job, Lenny. Nice job. Okay, so we got the girl. What now? Let's go. You stay put until Wade says otherwise. No getting high. No, no, no. The cops could be waiting outside. You fucking thought of that? We should get the hell out of here now. They won't be. We would know about it a long time ago, so relax, okay? wants a standoff. Keep it down, Jesus! What if that crazy shit heard you? Just shut up. Do what you're paid to do.
Dick now, you cocksucker! Make fun of me, I'll teach you a thing or two, I hope you die! Real hard and real long, you fucking motherfucker! And you, Baldy, don't you fucking move, or I'll put a, a fucking bullet in her head! That's what I'm saying! Wait, this is what happens when you fuck with Lenny! Don't you fuck with Lenny anymore! South Dakota, you're a long way from home. I got wood, man. Why do I have wood? for dragging me out here. Hey, I'm here to offer my services. You see, this kidnapping of yours, I'm worried that you have no idea who you're up against. I'm Bertie. I didn't know you cared. Let me take a closer look. Is this the face of a man I can trust? Dom is dead. Courtesy of the bald guy. And that means you need a new man on the inside. And who's better out there than me? Am I right? No, Bertie, you're not right. Because, see, I got the girl. And that means I don't really need you now, do I? Wait, 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 wait. Now, be cool, man. Come on, please. Listen. Look, you don't understand. You want the highest bidder? Then you need me to engineer the drop. That's what I do, man. <laughs> oh, right? Bertie, you think I can't make a simple trace on your phone call? I go real sick. Oh, that. Oh. Oh. Uh, it's a beautiful day. Bertie. Uh, who is, uh, what the hell is her name again now? Uh, Jade. Who's Jade? Fuck you, man. Oh, that, oh. oh now that's the wrong oh. answer. Damn, I love this country. A man can become anything he wants to be, as long as he's got the brains and the cojones. Okay, 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 she's a low level agency bitch. The agency? Are you telling me the agency's connected to Victoria? Yeah. Let him go. <laughs> Do you 
These are very dangerous people, man. If you screw them over, they will find you. But if you let me be the middleman, can't you see if it meant enough to them to send a fucking hit, man? Don't you see she's gotta be worth millions? Millions. <laughs> I'll take my chances. Oh, you're good this time, Bertie. You've been very useful. But if I see your weasel face again, I will bury you right here next to the Founding Fathers. I can promise you that. You know I will. I'm cool. I'm cool. Think you're gonna cut me out of the action? Well, you got another thing coming, man. I got a sorpresa for you. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, I got a surprise for everybody. Associate. He's back in town buying equipment. Oh, 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 is that so? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Well, what what kind of equipment might that be? Just equipment. Business equipment. Oh, I see, I see. Uh -huh. Big businessman. Well, uh, you just watch yourself now, because uh, we don't care too much for strangers around here. I'm not looking for trouble. Stranger.
us, there's no way this is Here, okay, please don't hurt me. I just worked here. Uh, 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 barbershop every day, 12 noon sharp. Hey, Holmes, how's country life? Locals treating you okay? Why don't you pop on over to my garments gun shop? Because I got you a little moving in present. Sir, I think you need to see this. Sir, you really need to see this. What? It's a gift. From an old connection. It's been off the grid for a couple of years now. Codename Birdie. <laughs> we codenamed a guy Birdie. No wonder he went off the grid. Just take them. You don't look much like a thief. It wouldn't be stealing. on the girl. Thanks, how are you? Whatever happened to common courtesy? Uh, hey man, I need some help. How can I help you, partner? Well, I uh, can't seem to find any shotgun ammo. Should be stocking back with all the other ammo. Yeah, I look, but I can't find it. Hello 
there. How you doing? Hey, you hear old Lenny's back? Oh, shit. Been nice and quiet without that cow pie. Yeah. Using the F word. <laughs> or a goddamn bullhorn right up the crack of that boy's ass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but his, his gimpy ass is probably <laughs> like that. <laughs> <laughs> Guns what like that up you. you? You see how she catches the light? Are you gonna be at the fair? Birdie was right. He's in Hope, South Dakota. And the girl? She's not with him. Okay, people, listen up. I'm giving a green light on this operation. I want 47's head on a platter in front of me ASAP. Sir, don't you think that our priority is on reacquiring the girl right now? No, Jay. First, we neutralize the rogue element that started this mess. He don't know where she is. Trust me. We get 47. We get the girl. We can't afford to fuck this up! It's time to send in the saints.
Tyler tell you about a plan of his? We grab the girl from under Dexter's nose, sell her off ourselves. And Tyler, he's already in touch with the competing arms company. We're talking six figures, man. Damn it. Mr. Dexter is not someone that you want to mess with. Too dangerous. Have you forgotten about Darian? Hey, what about Darian? Yeah, Darian. Darian messed up. All right, you ask me, he deserves what he got. Look, you want to be stuck here all your life doing the limp man's bidding? Come on, man, show some grit. Luke and Mason are in too. It, it'll be like the old gang. Nobody has to know. But you see, this is our moment, man. We just need to figure out where they stashed the girl. Hey, you know you can't park there, boys. Yeah, and yet we did. Yeah, well, I don't suppose you'd pay a damn ticket anyway. Yeah, I mean, why bother? I'd just take it out of your salary. Look, Gav, I'm gonna be straight, man. You're either with us, or you're against us, okay? And we both know what that means. Look, I gotta head over to the garage and put some pressure on the boys. Damn grease monkeys are late again. See you at the party. Nice day, huh? Sorry, sir. The store is closed. Perhaps for good. You're gonna have to take your shopping elsewhere. I sure hate to see this place go, Tyler. It's part of the town. Couldn't you talk to Lenny? Maybe he could put in a good word for you with his dad. Borrow money from Dexter? Are you kidding? That, that, that'd be like kissing a beehive. Look, don't worry, Lucy. Me and the boys, we got something planned. Something big. Just between you and me, I want to be out of here real soon. For good this time, maybe. I don't know, maybe, uh, California. I know. Wake up to the sound of seagulls. I mean, you, you know, you could always, um, you know, you could come with me. I mean, you know, if you wanted. To California? With you? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, I could I could always use a good waitress, you know. Yeah, okay, just uh just think about it, right? You know, and, and don't tell anybody. Success, fame, fortune. Has it suddenly lost all meaning? Do you feel like hey, the great do you mind if I turn it off? No That is not the price we agreed on. Don't you screw me on this. Listen to me. I don't care if you are the new CEO. That girl, that little bitch is worth every single penny. And we both... Hey, buddy, I'm not a shy guy.
sure you want to do this, Earl? I mean, a man could find himself real alone in this town, going up against Lenny and his boys. Besides, don't you have one of those gentlemen's agreements? You know, the kind I wouldn't know about, because I'm so busy looking the other way and all. think you're doing all right you hold still I'm coming to you don't do anything stupid Stand by while I check it out. Hey! Who's messing with that car? Chloe, it's me. No reason to worry. Everything's ready for you. Oh. Pretty bad day, huh? 
That guy, is he? I just, uh... Chloe, I got some noise here. No. No, no, no not in my head this time. Ha ha ha. Huh? Hey now, you think this is funny? I'm a cop. I'll put you behind bars, you hear? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Hey, listen, I said I got it. Hey, hey, hey. Put Chloe on. Come on, man, just put her on. Hey there, sweetie. You take care of it? Yeah? I bet you did. Okay, great. I'll see you in a little bit. See this bottle? You see what it says? Uh, spicy sauce? That's right. Now I do believe that I asked for hot sauce. Not pleasantly seasoned sauce or wuss flavored sauce. Hot sauce. Lenny just took out 50 men single handedly. You think he's gonna be impressed with the hotness of this sauce? I think not, my friend. I think not. Uh, uh. I'll go get another. Yeah, you do that. I want Hellfire Hot. Something that'll make your head explode. Hey, hey, you punk. What are you sneaking around for? You like, you playing spy games? Country and all. Feel like doing nutty shit? Be my guest.
Where's the damn ambulance? what that is. and set a good example. Maybe the idea would spread, you know? Like, uh, yeah, what's it called? Uh, the domino effect. We could save a whole generation. We owe it to the youth of America, goddammit. Right. Oh. Yes. Yes. Right. Well, I'm talking about watching. Yep. Really should. Oh, 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 I love this part of the show. Hey, hey, hands off the pizza. We made it especially for Lenny. You know, Chicago style. Well, good. Hey, how you doing, man? Town festival. I'm cursed, but that is. Was it? <laughs> Glad it was you. Ah, uh, okay. Who? God, who makes these things? It's like the Chinese. I could have been God. Thank God it was you. Hey, you! Hold on, huh? Hey! What was it? Oh, yeah, yeah, what was it? Go fuck yourself! That's what it was! Uh, 
Ah, Christ, look at you. Whew. Guess you should have stayed in bed today, huh? Never seen anything so bad. Where's help? Yo, oh, hey, hey, how you doing? <laughs> You're new, aren't you? Oh well, you know what they say here. Uh, a man who uh, who, who hey, argues with the barber huh? should have his head examined. Person, that is. Let's go. <laughs> See, Cal, time I talk, ain't enough for a guy like me. <laughs> You're not the talkative type, huh? <laughs> you know your place. <laughs> well, uh, I, I like that in the barber. God, Doc. How's our golden egg? That is exactly what she is, sir. She is extraordinary. We ran some tests on her. Her cells are enhanced somehow by an isotope in her, in her necklace. It's as if it rejuvenates her. Given the right training, she would be stronger or faster than any man. But when it's removed, she winkles somehow. <laughs> she is beyond perfect. I knew there was some reason the agency wanted her so bad. Jackpot! Ha <laughs> ha! Lenny. Lenny's been kidnapped. What? Who the fuck would dare fuck with me? Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it! You call Jade. Tell her to set up the ransom right now. And call the sheriff. Tell him I want my boy back. It's what the fuck I pay him for, goddamn fucking pervert. Oh, uh, Mrs. Cooper. Sheriff's office. Oh. How can I help you? It's for you. Skirky here. What? Layla, hi. What? No. I. God damn it! All right, I'm coming. Just hang it up.
Where's the girl? <laughs> Bob will kill me if I take you! I'll kill you if you don't. Oh, please! We was gonna give it right back. We was just trying to make some money, man. Last time. Where's Victoria? <laughs> Don't stop. <laughs> Pop told me to leave her with Sanchez. <laughs> Where do I find him? At the factory. Just south the town. Ask anybody to take it. He runs the fights there at night. All right? All right, you can stop digging. Can, can I get out of this hole now? Start walking. Oh, please. Please, that nun, she was an accident, man, okay? Please, I, I'm not gonna kill any more nuns, I swear. I just, just drive away. I, there's no need, there's no need to do anything. Don't put a bullet in me. I just, I gave you everything I wanted. Please, no more nuns, I swear. tracks and and they'll be here in an hour what no signal not even one little bar oh, stupid piece of shit you can put a guy on the moon but you can't get a decent goddamn signal <laughs> okay lady okay you were a cub scout remember that you got some pins you just need to locate the North Star. Yeah. <laughs> In the middle of the daytime. <laughs> Give me a fucking break. Oh, shoot. Oh, I'm gonna catch a cold. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Piss off, vultures. I ain't dead yet. I ain't dead. <sighs> Oh god, I'm so dead!
Okay, are we all here? Just about. The reserves are getting into position, but we're clamped down good already. Yeah, something's got the suits spooked. Yeah, that's why we can't be too careful. They got the old security cam control room up and running. You kidding? Oh, fuck, that's gotta be serious. It is, so we gotta get back to work. Yeah, see you later. Alpha 5 checking in, all clear. Over. Walk the walk. Dude, where you at? Seriously. Quit fucking hiding. God damn it! That's not even legal, man. How'd you do that? Yeah, now the student is the master. <laughs> Don't give me that karate kid bullshit. You hacked the game. Oh, sour grapes. There aren't supposed to be cheat codes for this game. Hey, right? I don't need no stinking cheat codes. You couldn't shoot your way out of a wet paper bag without the cheat codes. I kicked your ass. Get over it. Come on. Restart and hold your controller where I can see it this time. You are a glutton for punishment. Dishing it out. Yeah. Checking in, no sign of any.
Okay, well, did you try uh, try to restart? Yeah, is the little green light on the modem, is it blinking? Yeah, the one that says DSL. Uh, yeah, well, I don't know, I don't know. I, I, I'm kind of in the middle of something here, but give me a few minutes and uh, I'll be there. Can't be too sure. The orders say we gotta stay alert. Yeah, I know, I know. Just relax. We got the place clamped down. Just take a look. Yeah, Bones has got that covered. Wait, wait. Have we checked here? Yeah, I've been there. Don't worry, we got it covered. We've been working these mines for a long time. We know the place inside and out. Fine. We just can't be too sure. True. Come on, we won't be doing our job by staring at this map all day. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Okay. late for the briefing. Shit! We can't still make it, can we? Sure as hell better try. Carl a good time, and they're promising pictures of the cake. No cake for us tonight, boys. Without the team, don't need no singing cake. You got your assignments. Now go. Dude. Yeah, what is it? We gotta talk. Okay, let's walk.
two G's into the man, Dom. You gotta come across with the Benjamins. Hey, I'll have it after the fight. I got too big on Sanchez. That's money in the bank. Who gave you credit? Yeah, my girl backed me up. Your girl. Hey, what are you... Hey there, Monty. Road been good to you? Oh, yeah. It's all good. Got myself a new baby girl last month. Congrats. Thanks, yeah. Didn't figure on being a dad this late in life. You're not so old. Oh, heads up with the checks. The fat one's working the window today, and she's got some kind of hair up her ass. Awesome. 
Trying to make some kind of peace deal in South America. So what are you doing here? Teach me. I'm due for some grub. Right. See ya. Excuse me, sir. What is it? I would suggest you go inside, sir. I'll go inside when I'm ready. Sir, it's for your own safety. You have clearance to walk straight through. Okay, okay, I'll be there in a minute, okay? Thank you, sir. <coughs> yeah, I'm outside Dexter's now. Have the putts Mexicans paid yet? Good, okay. We'll start shipping the hardware. Hey, has Davis been briefed on how to get it over the border? All right, okay. So everything is on track. When I get back tomorrow, we'll celebrate. Yeah, yeah, but I, I don't think we should underestimate him. Business might not be as good as just after the New York thing, but under that eccentric exterior, I'm sure he's still a shrewd businessman. I'll do my best to squeeze a good price out of him. I just gotta find the right, uh, angle. All right, call me back in five, see what you can find. Don't think I can keep him waiting much longer. I'm serious. seem to be broken in Son. This is Alpha 5 checking in. All clear. Over. How do you do, sir? Right this way. I'm going for a smoke, doll. Enjoy. 
You're fucking kidding me. These mines are live? Yeah, they're live. But that's insane. We could all get blown to fucking shit. No one's gonna die. Been working this post for years and nothing's ever happened. Mr. Dexter just wants to prove a point of how safe these little bastards are. Oh, this is just wrong. Relax, okay? They need to be activated and tripped before they explode, so... Unless you're gonna be doing a spontaneous song and dance, Michael Jackson style, you got nothing to worry about. So I, I whisk the egg whites first, or melt the chocolate? Okay, okay, I got that. Oh, and, and whip the cream, and then melt the chocolate. Okay, oh, I got it. Uh, does it matter which chocolate I melt first? No, okay. I can remember that. Okay, leave to cool, yeah, I got that. And then into the freezer. Yeah, okay, that's great, thank you. Oh, she's gonna be psyched. Yeah, I'll let you know how it turns out. Okay, oh, I'll see you. All right, bye-bye. Look, pal, you better disappear. Now! Mr. Travis, it had better be a goddamn emergency. You know this is my... I'd be honored, Mr. T. God bless you. Let's get it together, bitches. That was the man. Not every day I get to kill the legend. You are now entering the Dexter Industries Research Facility, where the top minds of science and technology strive to make the impossible possible. Dexter Industries. Where the magic happens. Samantha, your 
It was, uh, Elliot and Philip, I believe. We can take you to court and drag it out for decades. We can indebt your grandchildren with the flick of a pen if you speak a word about what you saw. We'll give you a moment to think about it, Floyd. Goddamn wires.
strange lunatic breaks into the house while his parents are out of town. Yeah, the whole thing's just straight out of a horror film. The guy knocks the babysitter into a coma and throws Dr. Green into the kitchen. Supposedly, there was this incident back in the early 70s. Nasty business. The way I hear it, Dr. Green, 12 years old. supposed to be right below our feet. They were talking about it in the shower, the guards. I don't know. They were calling it the Omega facility. <laughs> Come on. The Omega facility? Are you kidding? <laughs> that sounds like an airport now. Yeah, well, that's what they Nice said. gear, uh, sir. Sanchez and underdog? There's an odd mix of words. Yeah, I used to be a patriot, man, but let's face it, he's past his prime. I got a feeling our boy Sanchez is gonna eat him for breakfast. Telling them we need to boost the pressure, make it a quick death. Activating mines in sector two. Starting up mines in sector three. Guard, I caught petting one of the test pigs. Who the hell is that?
Got his security clearance upgraded. Yeah, he's allowed into the silo now. Huh? Really? You uh, ask him what's going on down there? Or? I, I did ask, but they made him sign a phone book's worth of legal papers. Hey man, this is a public. Area. You know what? I'm gonna sneak in there. Huh. He's just behind the door. I don't care if it's loudy. I mean, I want to see. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Okay. In the shittiest fucking month, but tonight is gonna be the best day of my life. Sanchez will fucking rock the house. How you doing? I'm sure of it. No, I, I fucking know it. Can you feel it? Yeah. What you mean? It's gonna be killer. Oh, yeah, baby. I said it's up to said earlier look don't let it bother you the guy can be a bit harsh but hey that's geniuses for you you tend to lack a few social skills yeah i saw they brought her down yesterday pretty young girl mr dexter was here too yeah yeah in person he was talking to those eggheads for a long time i've never
Yeah, everything is secure. No one's gonna get through. Yep, the bridge is up. You can move the cargo. Got it. I'm already on top. My apologies, sir, but the orders came straight from I saw that. That Sanchez character? He just barged in and took off with the girl. Said the lab might be compromised. Something about Mr. Dexter's son being kidnapped? I don't know. How do you think Sanchez became Mr. Dexter's bodyguard? Yeah, those crazy muscles of his? Let's just say he didn't get them by doing evil shots. Uh, you go and see what's happening. Forgive me, sir. But I have no idea. <laughs> Probably nothing. All right, sir. Move ahead with the scheduled test. Get me the board of directors. Okay, finally stopped. You know what? I don't even give a crap. There's a car alarm. I understand. Hey, 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 watch, watch it, buddy. It, Hey, what's happening?
Remember to adjust the serum. The isotope level is still way too high. Chair been recalibrated. Last dosage was too strong. No point in killing these people before we can monitor the effect. Oh, never mind, I'll do it myself. I've got some kind of accident on my hands here. I'm gonna take a look at it.
you kidding me? All right, what is it now? My backstage key card. It was right goddamn here. I know I had it on me. Oh, man, yeah. Been there, done that. Yeah, lost mine last week. Had to run and push my way through the audience all night. It was such a bitch. Yeah, not to mention the management. Yeah, they deduct the damn things from your pay. They do that? Sweet. This is great. Come on, hey, give me a hand. Help me look for it, will you? Anyone? Sure, why not? Beats scratching my ass. Hello? Stop this shit, will ya? Customers here, just protecting your investment. No, don't, don't worry. Sheriff Skirky's got her in his basement detention, and nobody gets in or out of that place without his permission. I'll pick her up right after the fight. Got it. She won't leave my sight again.
around here. What just happened? base. Now it's silent like the grave here. Copy that. Staying vigilant. to the Waikiki Inn. <laughs> Would you care to register, sir? Ben Franklin. Oh, right this way, sir. We have a continental breakfast from seven to nine in the Tiki Lounge. A happy hour is from five to eight in the Tiki Lounge. My ties are two for one pina coladas or- Anything less festive. Can I bring a bottle to your room, Mr. Franklin? Something brown. Yes, sir.
parcel in the parking lot. Mark for pickup. Over. Strike team, retrieve 47's body. Clean up crew, take care of any survivors. Move out! Okay, listen up. We follow the public operations protocol, section three. No survivors, no bodies, no trace. Total spring cleaning. Please, I didn't see anything. I haven't seen your face. <laughs> Don't do this! Don't hurt me! Command, I'm wrapping up a parcel in Sector 2. Requesting pickup. Over. Where did management pick up these women, anyway? They make my blood run cold. I hear they're one of Travis's initiatives. Finds them all over the world, apparently. Civil war orphans, domestic abuse victims, convicted prisoners. You name it. He gives them a home, trains them, focuses their rage. Jesus, that Travis. He's nothing if not inventive. Eyes open, we've got trouble. Ambulance on its way, we gotta get going.
What do you mean, no reply? Raise them again. Yes, ma'am. Calling Saints Team 1. Come in, Saints Team 1. Report. Over. Nothing but static. What was their last location? First floor walkway, ma'am. Perplexing. Keep trying, soldier. Let me know the instant you make contact. Sir, this operation concerns national security. Search the cornfield. Yes, ma'am. Listen up. We have orders to sweep the cornfield. Standard two by two grid formation. Move out. Over. Give it up, 47. We know you're out there. Roger that, over. Cleanup team just found the bodies of Saints Team 1. It was the work of a professional. Our target is still on the loose.
Doesn't have to end like this, 47. Give yourself up and we'll take you in alive. A sloppy somewhere out there. <laughs> Surrounded. Let us bring you in, and Travis will cut you a deal. Target is in the vicinity. Look alive. and you betrayed the agency. I saw him get up and walk away after that fall. Oh yeah, like a walking, talking angel, man. Can you describe it? <laughs> get out of here! You're wasting my time! Twenty people saw him, man. Not a single one can describe him apart from being bald with a tattoo on the back of his neck. You really think it's the hitman? I don't care if it's the fucking tooth fair, I'm gonna get him. Detective. This was left at the front desk. Kid said, give it to whoever's looking for the hitman.
Location for the ransom exchange is set? Yes, sir. Blackwater Park. I've already assigned three teams for you. Good. We get the girl, make sure she's secure, then we take them all out and get our money back. Ransom is not in the agency budget this year. <laughs> Hope, South Dakota, <laughs> to watch the myth die. Next matter of order, Dexter Industries versus Kevin Zimmerman. Trespass. Where's the prisoner, Sheriff? <clears throat> Your Honor, uh, the uh, prisoner had a uh, unfortunate accident in his cell this morning, and uh, he's on his way to the infirmary. Mm, I see. You think he'll pull through? <laughs> Not looking good. I... He fell pretty hard. <coughs> Case dismissed. Well, I think I'm gonna... mosey on down to the jail and check on the jailbirds. All right, Your Honor. Where were we? People versus Timothy Hawk, charged with breaking and entering. Cigarette right about now. Ah, relax. Just tell the truth and you'll be fine. Yeah, that's not what my lawyer's been telling me. It's just, I read stories about that book. You have a nice day now. So this bald guy walks into a bar, right? Hold on now. Sir? A joke? You look like no, you're suffering no, from a listen. bad case of Montezuma's revenge. Oh, you need assistance? Yeah. He's talking about the great balls of fire. Okay. Right? Carry on. Yeah, right, right. So, so he walks into the bar, holds the bar, and he goes, Any of you sorry ass sons of bitches seen Lenny the Limp? <laughs> like throwing a match on a pile of dynamite. Shit, yeah. I heard it was a hell of a ruckus even for that shithole. I just thought it was another trucker versus biker thing, though. Am I wrong? Yeah. Yeah. That's what's so weird. No one really wants to talk about it, but... The guys who've been looking into it, well, they say the bald guy kicked the living shit out of nearly everyone in the bar. One guy against that crew? No fucking way. Hey, you know, that's what the grapevine's saying. Don't hang the hangman. <laughs> yeah, well, they... Crystal Math is saying things now, don't they? Yeah, sure. Grapevine says a lot of things. But I'm not talking about the grapevine. I'm talking about the cops investigating. Come on, stupid. Use your brain. 
only way one guy takes on a bar full of 50 bikers and truckers is with an automatic weapon. You know, from what I heard, this is just an old-fashioned barroom brawl. Come on, man, think about it. It's physically impossible for one guy to do that. I don't care if he's fucking 10 feet tall. My nurse, you know, this whole British thing. I mean, the powdered wigs and dry biscuits are bad enough. But he's got us watching cricket matches now. And he insists that I translate witness statements into British. No, no kidding. I mean, I'm changing asshole into arsehole. And uh, what the hell into blimey. Seriously, blimey, who says that? I thought the whole point of court transcribing was accuracy, you know? Right, look, anyway, just ask Bill for me, okay? Thanks, son. Hear ye, hear ye. Court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Strickland presiding. Case dismissed. What the hell is that shit? Where are my fucking nose and two of them are Where are you, Lord? Honor. Woo! This is an outrage. Woo! Order. Court adjourned. That man was guilty. Guilty. Court will now take a 45 minute recess. Are you, are you ready for the inspection? Well, come on, follow me. Well, Jesus, heard you let that old tin head go. <laughs> That's gonna piss off a lot of people. If you don't mind me speaking adult like to you, Judge.
Hey, ship up that fly. We got an important visitor. Hey, asshole. Can't you see I'm reading my titty story adventures? It's a judge, you numbnuts. Oh, ho holy crap. I'm sorry, Your Honor. Uh, please, uh, please inspect the cells. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't let you into the main prison today. Oh, the prisoners are pretty rowdy inside. You know, you know what I mean. The sheriff has ordered the place locked down until the situation's under control. It's for everyone's safety, Your Honor. Ah, you utterless cowpie. Yeah, and, and don't mind me. If you need anything, just ask. You should have given me a heads up, asshole. Don't be too rough on him now, boys. Hey, dumbass. Sheriff Skirky says, Ha! Hey, you can't do that! Triangle? No, 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 no. That's what? Yeah, I think the uh, drugs are getting into it again. Uh, I'm not going to go there.
remember when I was your age. God. I didn't know. There you go. Ho, ho, ho! Down for the count. How about a little extra just to make sure your cook feels good? Hey, yeah, Dexter. Yeah, hey, no problemo. Yeah, just some bald fuck. Told you I'm a professional. <laughs> yeah, he's sleeping like a baby. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Dexter. Morning to you. Well, well, well. Where's my boy? Where is my boy, you son of a bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Tough? You got it, asshole. See that little girl over there everybody's so fond of? Well, my scientists tell me that this is what revs her up. Look at her now. Weak as a little kitten. Ow! Mr. Dexter, fuck off! place you running here, Clive? Hell, that ain't mine. Jesus Christ, you... That's Mrs. Cooper. Sick fuck. You killed my boy, didn't you? Look, man, just tell him what he wants to know. Accidents happen in this jail all the time. Hey, Mr. Dexter, come on. You go on about your business. I'll take care of this guy. Let's go. I want my boy back, Clive. I ain't let you down yet, have I? Go on. But you and me now. God damn it. It's typical. Just typical. I'm on it! Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll do. Thought I was just a sergeant. You look, look very happy. Probably had a session, if you know what I mean, right? <laughs> anyway, I left the pistolas for you to pick up at the front desk. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they are beauts. Actually, uh, I'm thinking of using them for my son's birthday. Ah, yeah. Ten years old. <laughs> yeah, I tell you what, he's a big boy now. Gonna take after his pop. And you know what? Big boys. They require big guns, that's right. <laughs> All right, brother. Talk to you soon. Bye.
Every year at the Hope Fair, we have to haul your drunken ass in here. I'm not drunk. I'm just fast Please. I can smell it from over here. So what is it this year? Defecating in the water fountain? Interrupting the mayor's speech by publicly declaring to be Jesus? Nah, just a bit of the old drunk driving. Fire, yeah. Merle, we took away your license months ago. You know better than that. Okay, put him in a holding cell. Let him sleep it off. This is a miscarriage of justice. I demand to talk to Sheriff Skirky. Ah. Skirky? You are drunk, ain't you? Sorry, Merle. Yeah. The sheriff just threw one of his tantrums. Trust me, you do not want to bother him. Just get yourself some shut eye, you hear? Chloe will fetch you an answer. I don't normally complain, but it's every 30 minutes or so. You kept me up all night, and it's right before fair day, too. I'm trying to win a goldfish. Those are Dexter Industry trucks. My hands are tied. Oh, bullshit. I want to file a formal complaint. I didn't drive down my street They can take another road. Sorry, Dustin, but you gotta take it up with City Hall. They're the ones greenlighting the convoys. I wouldn't hold my breath, though. You know Dexter Industries employs half a hope, so they get a lot of leeway. Faces it. He looks a bit like that.
stop that. Stand up. Take point. Come on, it, sir. Don't I know him from the academy? Hey. Anyone there? There's no one here. Oh. The target won't be able to get through this way. Come on, let's move out. We need to sweep the parking lots. Our window of opportunity is closing fast. Shop at 45 degrees southwest. Over. Roger that, Rabbit. Get in position. We'll flush out the target. Over.
Please, sir, behave in an orderly fashion. Church. Last time, where's Victoria? Oh, go fuck yourself! Blackwater Park! Blackwater Park! Forty-seven. Tom, I need a new suit. Oh, Mr. Forty-seven. What a pleasure. Oh. 
Yes, yes, I can tell. You need a new suit. Now, please, follow me. Come this way, come this way, come on. Come to my dressing room. Please, step inside, 47. I'll just wait up here. It's quite an improvement over your old suit. Look, handcrafted wool, reinforced seams, invisible stitching, and, of course, silk linings. Fits like a glove. <laughs> Would there be anything else? Dickhead, where's the girl? <laughs> oh, Layla. See? Girl's a one piece. You want to keep her that way? I want to see 10 million right now, like we agreed. Well, now about the money. I don't have that kind of signing authority. You what? You don't have what? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, no, no, no. See, that's not how this works, partner. Because you better find someone who's got the authority right now, or the deal's over. 
You got the three. Well, let me talk to my superior. Three. <laughs> the fuck! <laughs> Fucking asshole, what the fuck are you doing? God Aww. damn it! Did that upset you? I'm sorry. <laughs> Well, the fun's over, Hancho. Ten million right now. And you fuck with me, it'll be ten million more. Throw in the split tail. Okay, asshole. You made your point. You're a nice piece of ass, honey. What are you doing with Limp Dick? Pig. You have no idea. Hey, fuck off! Where's the girl? <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll give you a call in a little while, I'll let you know where you can find Victoria. Come on, darling. Making money makes me horny. You gave that psychopath our money just like that? Yeah, well, he's not as dumb as he looks. Nobody outruns the agency. me I just hope we can get in hey uh, excuse me excuse me sorry sir ma'am Blackwater is temporarily shut down no one can enter and no one can leave um excuse me we live here I understand but there is a potential threat what kind of threat yeah we're not sure ma'am you gotta you gotta be kidding me I don't believe it you don't get it we live here I understand now you must understand there is a potential threat here so please, try and find some other accommodation tonight. Well, I am friends with the Alderman of this district, and he is going to hear about this. Yeah, yeah, good evening to you, too. Fuck it. Ah, uh, yeah, just let a plumber through. The papers were in order.
He's not the one who got shit in his socks. Out this there, way. yeah, this but uh, it's pretty nuts in here, too. What are you talking about? What do you mean? Jesus, yeah. see that? they're getting ready for a lockdown downstairs. This, uh, lockdown, yeah, people got drunk. And were what if we need something? All over the place and and tough shit, I guess. I mean, I, I fucking don't fucking know. Bloody. Why don't you I'm ask him? Hey, I only know about the outside. I just came in to get some warmth. Come on, you try to tell me you don't know about the suits. Yeah, yeah, I heard about it. Oh, come on, I don't know. This is this just starting to freak me out. Hey, at least you're not out in the rain. Oh, you seen those monkey robots upstairs? Carrying enough weapons to start World War III? Now, nah, you ask me if I'd rather be outside in the rain? Um, hell yes. Okay, jeez, chill. Uh, but don't you tell me to relax. I know my rights, mister, okay? And I got people bitching at me about not being able to leave, okay? Wow. <laughs> you really love your job, huh? <laughs> don't get me started. Yeah, I think I already have. I need the manager at temp. If you see him, ask him to find me. I'll open the elevator door for him. Don't worry about that. I can use the override switch. No one but me lets people into that elevator. Understood? Okay, jeez, chill. What did you say? Yes, ma'am. Understood. Uh, sorry, ma'am. That's what it sounds like. Close your mouth, boys. Makes you look smarter than you really are. You. Um, yeah. You want to talk to me? <laughs> yes. Uh, you see, the manager would very much like to talk to you. What does he want? The situation is not going to change. We still have a potential threat. Got it, asshole? Isn't she lovely? Like a pit viper. Tell him he has five minutes. I'll meet him in the conference room. Ugh, she is such a classy bitch. Yeah, I do her. Yeah, but then again, what's that saying? You know, because of that bitch, we don't even have access to the upstairs. Sir, can I help you?
How you doing? You are invading my personal space, sir. Special forces. You'll find cool. it easy to, want to learn this for a while. Years, since close combat Fine. encounters Something we can use in limits the field. you to only making contact once, you'll find the techniques extremely effective. We're going to go through some distracting techniques right. and blocks. Many of you will learn some punches you might not know, for instance, how to break your opponent's knuckles and elbows using your own elbow. We're also covering how to assist a partner if he is attacked. Finally! Took you long enough! Move it! Let me get you in! Mm. Okay, there you go. Get back here as soon as you're done. Mr. Dexter, he shot out the camera in the elevator. Coming our way. Yes, sir, Ray! You know, they say well can be a great burden, but I'm willing to take it on, I'll tell you. Holy shit! Yes! That's a lot of fucking do Ray me right there, and that's <laughs> ours! That's mine! Here, buy yourself some lipstick. God damn, that's a lot of money. Yeah. What? Fuck! Are you fucking kidding me? What does it take to kill this son of a bitch? I want him dead right now. You kill him right now, you hear me? You think you can do that? No, of course you can't do that, because you're a bunch of fucking pussies. I have to do fucking everything around here. Easy, Jesus baby. fucking Christ. It's okay, baby. No, it's not okay. That bald fuck is coming to kick my ass. Jesus, no, fuck. Layla's got what it takes to stop any man. You know, I think you might have something there. I'm counting on you. Come on, Angel. Let's go. I'm counting on you. I got this. It's number 22 on its number 25. It's number 55 on the second floor. Jesus! <sighs> What's wrong with me, huh? You think I got dyslexia? Oh, God! 
Oh, you think I'm just stupid? Man, I'm probably just stupid. That's what my mom would say. Just stupid. You think I should get tested? Maybe I should get tested. Is there a test for dyslexia? Whoa, dude, you got a gun! How cool is that? Hey, it's just the sushi guy. Who ordered sushi? Miss Stockton did. Jesus, pick up the sushi and see Miss Stockton gets it. Don't touch anything in there. is coming. He might already be here. And you're sitting there jacking off? Hey, 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 wait a minute. I have orders to check all rooms. Mr. Dexter doesn't want anyone in here, man. How can we secure all rooms if we... This room is off limits. Hey, come on, let's face it. The room's not gonna be used anymore. Mr. Dexter still has faith. His son's been missing for days now. Call it morning or whatever you want. This room is sacred to him for the time being, so it's off limits.
guards at all ground entrances. And the lobby is under control. What am I to say? Nothing. Just let him come. I have a little surprise for him. Whale skeleton? Are you kidding me? What, he bought it from a museum or what? Did you not see the painting of Mr. Dexter with Moby Dick over he there? He killed that thing? With his own hands. Well, with a harpoon. But still, the harpoon's on exhibit as well. Pretty cool, man. So what is he, Alan Quartermain? Alan Quartermain is a fictional character. Mr. Dexter is the real deal. This sector's clear, we're moving further in. Uniform is on. We'll link up with you guys further up. You're a hard man to kill. I love a hard man. Where is Victoria? Oh, Vicky. <laughs> Let's not talk about her. Let's talk about us. Better yet, let's not talk at all. When was the last time you relaxed? Let huh? Layla take you to heaven. Sedate the 
girl and get her in the chopper. <laughs> Crazy. Blowing up your own building to stop one guy? Shit like that would put anyone on edge. Command, charges 7 through 12 are live. Over. Why is he heading that way? Attention Alpha Unit, and C, watch your steps. We don't want a chain reaction on our hands. Over. Jesus! Can't see a goddamn thing out here.
My money. Your money? Come on. Let's go. It's over. Dear 47, if you read this letter, I am most likely dead. You will have shot me for a traitor, and Travis will have won. Do not let him have the girl as well. Travis's division was conducting genetic experiments without the agency's knowledge, and Victoria was their crowning achievement. Give her the choice you never had. Protect Victoria and kill Benjamin Travis. Good luck, 47. All civilians have been escorted from the premises. We have the place to ourselves. Travis, is the line secure? Go ahead. We've located the Burnwood family gravesite. Very well. Proceed with the exhumation. Honestly, I don't know what you expect to find. Our investigation was thorough. Diana Burnwood died that day. We have the police and autopsy reports. 47 himself confirmed the kill. What more do you want? We've underestimated 47 more than once. No, I don't buy it. Burnwood is more than capable of faking her own death. She could outsmart you in a heartbeat. Fredrickson tells me you were on the assault team in Hope. Guess that place got leveled pretty good, huh? Oh, it was a mess. Totally out of control. Yeah, well, you guys covered your tracks, right? The Feds are treating it as a terrorist attack. Some kind of homegrown right-wing anarchist group. Yet yeah, still, exposing ourselves like that on U.S. soil? You ask me, Travis is a loose cannon. It's only a matter of time before management shuts him down. Stand up! And that's not a request.
way I see it, she's just weird. All's clear on our end. Doctor, a word, please. Travis wants a complete DNA analysis of the body. Don't forget, Burnwood was part of this division for years. Whatever we are capable of, she is as well. I expect the results by tomorrow.
get it, did you, you big ball fuck? <coughs> she was made to be a killer, just like you! <coughs> it was gonna be... perfect. Uh, all right. Just tell me... Did you kill her? <coughs> Diana... She really did. You will never know. Diana, do what you have to do. Excellent work, 47. The money has been wired to your account. Welcome back, and thank you. Who are you? <clears throat> you really want to know? I can help you find them. For a price, of course.
cross the line Let them bang Not let them bang Means I'm coming After you And though you run a mile My boots will bring the trial You're on the land But here I am I'm